I am Dr. Sharjeel and you are watching my YouTube channel. If you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe my channel at the end. Now, you all know that uh, this is a case of ocular surface squamous neoplasia in an elderly female lady. Now, ideally, I perform excision biopsy with cryo or electrocautery to the scleral bed or excision with the use of intraoperative mitomycin C but uh, there is a variety of patients some patients are reluctant to go for the surgery and they want medical treatment so medically we have got again topical mitomycin C drops are prescribed as well as interferons alpha 2b now today I would like to tell you how to prepare topical as well as subconjunctival interferon alpha 2b drops because many of my friends they were asking me that how it is given topical as well as subconjunctival so I asked my friends and Dr. Wakar uh, graciously told me how it is prepared so interferon comes uh, in injection uh, 5 million international units in a powder form now you have to dilute that uh, with either 5 ml distal water or 5 cc artificial tears uh, and uh, that will now make it uh, 1 million international units per ml and that is the dose for topical as well as subconjunctival use so for topical use put these ready-made solution in a drop bottle and use it QID four times per day for at least three months to have some effect and you have to follow the patient two to four weekly to assess any side effects like uh, burning itching sensation or punctate keratopathy and if the patient have these side effects uh, then you can add preservative free lubricant uh, as well now results are very encouraging and after three months use the OSN OSSN should regress remarkably and it may disappear uh, as well and some people use interferon and then when it uh, reduces uh, surgi surgically remove it